Hello, my friends. I just got a very exciting package in the mail. It's a bookshelf. I'm going to be re, oh, there's a Liz. Say hi, Liz. Hi. I'm redecorating. I'm getting, I got a new bookshelf. It's one that fits into the corner. So this is the little corner where I do my filming in my bedroom. And I'm just kind of sick of the way it looks. Usually I have a bunch of pillows right here that I sit on to film. And this is the background. And I'm gonna get rid of all of this <clears throat> and get a nice fancy bookshelf to go to fit right in this corner. So yeah, I'm just kind of sick of the way it looks. I want a nice setup for filming, but also I want to create like a really nice reading nook. Eventually I want to get a nice reading chair to put here, but the first step is the bookshelf. So we got the bookshelf, I'm gonna unbox that, put it together, but I think before I put it together, I'm gonna move all of these books. So I'm gonna move all the books, put them on the bed, and then this is actually gonna go over here by the window as like a nightstand for my husband because that's his side of the bed so that's gonna go there and then i'm gonna set up my nice new bookshelves and i thought i'd take you along with me throughout the process i hope you enjoy let's let's get started <laughs> Liz. Okay. okay, so now we need to move this and it's probably a mess back here. Yep, I'm gonna have to vacuum. There we go. Look at all these books. This is ridiculous. This is my whole TBR plus the books on the TBR cart. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with this cart. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it in here or move it to the living room. I'm not sure yet, but that's a lot of books, you guys. <laughs> okay, the area is clean and vacuumed, and now it's time to put together the shelf. Hopefully I can do this on my own. If not, the husband's on standby. So, we'll see.
Hello friends, the shelf is finally done. I cut out a lot of the assembly part of it because I kept doing things wrong and getting frustrated and crying, uh, but I got help and it's finally put together and I love it so much. Here's what it looks like. It fits perfectly in this little corner, um, just shy of the outlet. And I love it. I love the wood. I love the color. I love the color. I love the way it looks. And it just, it just fits so nicely here. So now I just need to set it up. Got my glass cleaner there. I was cleaning it off. Um, and, you know, a nice little chair maybe here or just maybe like right in front of it. Maybe a little side table. I don't know, but I... I'm obsessed, I love it. Now we just need to organize it. Um, I think I want to get another plant <laughs> for in here and maybe put a plant up there. Um, I'm going to put my tarot cards up on the top and then start organizing the books. I have no idea how I'm gonna organize the books, but I'm thinking that I want to do it by color. Not like a rainbow, but just put like the black books together, the white books together, something like that. So we'll see. a decorative shelf in case unless I need extra <clears throat> room for books I want to get I'm going to put a plant here maybe like a pothos yeah. something hanging right? I don't know what that means. and then I put my tarot cards up here I didn't realize what those were mm -hmm. tarot cards and books I'm assuming so what I want to do is kind of do black like by color but not rainbow does that make sense? So I want like black books together, black spines together, white spines together. Is this where I be a smart ass? Go ahead. I know you want to. All books matter. I hate you. I have books here I honestly have forgotten about. That's when you know you have way too many books on your TBR. I'm gonna try to organize them by height too. I think that'll look nice. So let me give you a little tour.
Okay, so top shelf, I've got my tarot cards, my Night Circus print, more tarot cards, oracle cards, and my little L for my name. And then I wanted to do like white books together, black books together, red books together. It didn't quite work out that way because my spines weren't cooperating. Um, but I have my little white section here with some little decorations. I absolutely love this planchette uh, incense holder. It's so cute. And I do use it, but I mostly display it because I love the way it looks. My little skull. Um, I've got some candles in there. And then we've got the little section of red books. We've got the black spines. I've got my organite tower and some tumbled crystals in this little dish here. And then on the third shelf, we have the blue books. We've got a little stack of books here, which are no particular color. My little cauldron sitting on top of it and the greenish, greenish books here. And then next shelf down, we have a little bit of blue. We've got yellows and oranges and purples and moving into like the lighter colors, gray, whitish, I don't know. And then on the bottom shelf here, I have all of my short story collections. They're either short story collections or like bind ups of books. That's the word I was looking for. Um, another huge stack right here with a little candle. And then this basket has some of my keepsakes in it. It's also got like thesauruses, dictionaries, um, bigger witchcraft books that don't quite fit on the shelf very well. So I've got all that in that little basket and that is, that is it. Um, I also still have, I decided to keep my TBR cart here. So, um, all of these, it's not organized right now, but the top shelf will be all the books that I've either read for that month or plan on reading soon. Once again, plan on reading soon. And then down here is where I'm going to keep all of the books that I've hauled for a particular month that are waiting for me to do a book haul video. There's definitely a lot of room here that I could play around with. I could face out some books. I could kind of change the layout a little bit, not have so many stacked because I do have, I do have some extra space. So a lot to work with. I'm probably going to keep tweaking it and adding more decorations and stuff like that. But this is the way it looks for now. I am super happy with it. I love, I love this shelf so, so much. Um, and now all I need is a little reading chair to sit and read in the corner. But yeah, that is the completed project. It feels so incredibly nice to finally be done with this project. Like I said, there's still some things I want to do. I want to get more decorations to add to the shelves. I'm probably going to be tweaking it around a little. I might reorganize it completely. Who knows? But I'm absolutely in love with this bookshelf. Tell me what you think about it down in the comments. And I hope you enjoyed the video. That is going to be it from me today. If you enjoyed, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.